Joining forces for a better future, city and business leaders working together to address a pervasive systemic issue in Detroit to help grow economic mobility. Yeah, they're creating the Motor City Contractor Fund. 7 Action News reporter Kim Russell takes a look at how it aims to change lives and create new jobs. There are so many big building projects underway in Detroit, you might assume it's a time of great growth for all Detroit contractors. But for many, there's one big barrier to opportunity. They don't have the cash needed up front to take part in big projects, but now a solution. I would honestly say millions of dollars of opportunities are just in my inbox right now. Dina Neely is a licensed electrical contractor, founder and CEO of Detroit Voltage. She says she mostly takes on small residential work where she can charge a down payment up front. She would like to take on bigger commercial jobs but most require she cover a lot of costs. You will have to not only be able to float a job and pay for your electricians, right, for 30 days up front before we even get our first drop and our, our first payment. Um, we would also have to pay for materials up front, supplies and things of that nature. That's without even receiving a dollar. And you can't perform if you don't have access to capital. Dennis Mitchell is the director of community engagement for Barton Mallow, the largest commercial contractor in the state of Michigan. Today, Barton Mallow, the Rocket Community Fund, Community Reinvestment Fund, and Invest Detroit announced the launch of the Motor City Contractor Fund pilot program. It will provide Detroit-based contractors with loans and mentoring, addressing systemic inequities in the business. And the problem is that minority-owned contractors have historically been turned away from traditional lending institutions. When they do receive loans, they're often at higher interest rates. When you're providing them with industry-leading uh, role models, mentors, as well as pairing them up with the proper capital needed, you're going to see that contractor soar. Neely stood on stage as the program was announced. She says she sees barriers to her success disappearing before her eyes. Now this allows me to go after that work that's there really waiting on me. For more information about this fund and how you can apply, go to our website, WXYZ.com. We'll have links posted. Kim Russell, 7 Action News.